hi guys welcome back to my channel i am back with another video another vlog another week in my life um and as you can see i'm looking a bit crusty my hair needs to be done my nail look at my nails guys like oh it, it's bad so i'm gonna use this vlog as like a maintenance vlog but a self-sufficient girly maintenance vlog because I'm gonna try to do most of the things myself like I'm gonna wax I'm going to take off these nails I just I really just want to take them off and let my nails breathe um what else that's basically it <laughs> and I want to do some self-care um, it's a Saturday. I'm at home. I'm not doing much. So I thought let me do some self-care as you can see my skin has not been doing so great lately So I just want to do some masks um, You know just to make myself feel good and also, you know, hopefully do something about how it's looking right now, you know um, Yeah, so that's mainly basically What's gonna be happening in this vlog? I'm gonna wax my chin. That's what we're gonna do now and then we'll see where the rest of the vlog goes but let's just get into it don't forget to like comment subscribe you know do the things and then we can just start this vlog okay so i'm just gonna show you guys how i usually do my wax well this is only the second time i do it but anyway so i use this wax warmer that i got from a uh, china cash and carry so as you can see there's already some wax there that was from my previous um wax session um i just left it in there it dried up so i'm just gonna warm it up so at the beginning i just put it on the max temperature and then i'm just gonna let it sit there and warm up um, i'll just cover it with the lid to let it warm quicker and then i use these sticks that you can literally get anywhere be creative um, as you can see this is after some time the wax is all like watery so I'm just going to turn down the temperature to get it a little thicker because we don't want it to be like watery you know so I'm just going to turn down the temperature for it to cool down and get the right consistency as you can see here it's a bit thicker I'm just turning it around the stick and letting it cool off before putting it on my skin once it's cool you can just put it on your skin as you can see here i let it cool a little too much and that's why it's not just like laying on my skin as it should we live and we learn <laughs> um but yeah just gonna do that and then twist it around to get that extra wax off and then i'm just gonna pat it to make sure that it's dry and it's ready to be pulled off basically once it's dry you just lift a bit of the edge off then pull as you can see there's some hair there not all so i'm gonna just repeat the whole process and i like to leave the strips in the lid so that i can just keep everything organized and easier to clean up later on so yeah i just repeated the process until i was happy um, once that was done i just used a tweezer to lift the small hairs that were left then I usually go in with some tea tree oil. Um, I just really love tea tree oil for my skin. It really helps with the redness and just bumps in general. Then I follow with my cream. This is actually cream that I use for my eczema. So I'm just trying to avoid getting any eczema from the wax. Okay, that's the end of the wax. Um, as you guys saw, um, I'm still learning. I I'm still learning, but I think this should be good for now. And after the cream, it feels good. Um, I'm, I'm happy. I'm happy with my wax. Anyway, I'll see you guys in a bit. Um, probably just gonna chill now. I was thinking of going to a mall. To spend money that I don't have, I really want some new sweatpants with winter, with this colder weather coming through. But I'm kind of lazy now and they probably close at 5, maybe even earlier and it's already like 4. So we'll see, we'll see.
guys so it's been a minute as you can see i look different um this morning i did a home workout because i wanted to go for a jog for a run but it was raining and then i was too lazy to drive to the gym so i was like i'm just gonna do this home workout but anyway i also wanted to do it at home because i knew i wanted to go to the salon to go do my hair but then I, when i called the salon they were like come at 12 so it, actually i could have went to the gym but anyway i did these twists um i really wanted to this was the first time i go to this uh lady because i heard she's really good with natural hair she didn't even blow dry my hair no heat no nothing so she is good in that sense and i wanted to do a hairstyle like this that will you know really go well with my natural hair so that even when it starts like aging the hairstyle starts aging my natural hair doesn't look too bad i don't know if that's true but we'll see um but we've got a bit of a problem i just realized that home that like there's just a few that are just like hanging like there's just a few that are just hanging and i think i need to fix that but other than that i really like the hair hi guys morning it is monday morning i'm getting ready to go to work i'm actually so late because i wanted to be at work at six because Mondays are hectic and I like to start my day early. But it's currently 6 and I'm having my breakfast. Ooh, the lighting is crazy. I'm having some muesli though. Um, yeah, guys, I left you off yesterday. Because I was trying to do my nails, take off these nails. But it didn't work. It didn't work. So I basically just cut them and filed them. But, yeah. <sighs> I don't want to go to work. It's, uh, it's so cold, like, I knew it was cold, but, like, it's a bit too cold. <gasps> no, I just dropped my gun. And I'm late. This hair is making my forehead look so big <laughs> and my forehead is already big but I wanted to show you guys my work OOTD today it's this polo neck because it's cold that I got from Shein my work pants and I'm just wearing my uh, workout sneakers because I did inspections last week and now my boots are dirty and I haven't gotten the chance to clean them. Actually, I forgot to clean them over the weekend. Anyway, I'm late. I have a meeting on site in like 15 minutes. And it takes about 15 minutes to drive to site. And I'm hoping there's no traffic. Mm. And I can put you in. I can put you in. I've been a throw up the sex in a. So today is Saturday. 
um it's still early i think it's about it's probably like nine now um and i'm i want to head to the mall because i feel like spending money <laughs> kiki <laughs> that's so bad please don't be like me but like spending money is so therapeutic whether it's there or not let's just talk about how therapeutic it is anyway i need to get a few things like my contact lenses solution and maybe a few groceries and i also want to go into cotton on because yeah i feel like spending money <laughs> but other than that um this morning started really good i took a run i took a 5k run on a new route and it was actually so enjoyable so at least the morning started good it started early now i'm probably gonna be passed out by midday because i'm feeling tired already but let's just let's just go to the mall for now <laughs> I don't know, I really like the top. <laughs> I really like the top. It's warm, it's very like, fits nice on the body. I'm not sure about the sweatpants though. I'm not sure about the sweatpants. I don't know why I'm not sure. <laughs> they got the straps inside i really wanted to go for a baggy look this is medium should i go baggier is that the problem so these are the pants this set i don't know if it's actually a set but thin color it, it feels amazing back from the mall so let's do a little haul <laughs> let me tell you i was supposed to get a lot more stuff i was supposed to go to checkers but i went to cotton on clicks and then woolworths and then after that i was like i'm done with this like i really don't like going to the mall <laughs> so i was like you know what? it's what i need from checkers i'll order online that's how much i don't like the mall I was at the mall, but I came home to order something that I could have gotten at the mall. Okay, starting with the cotton on purchase, like you guys saw in the video, I decided not to get those pants and the and the sweatpants because I don't know. I feel like yeah, I'm on the edge with the sweatpants, so I thought I'd just think about it or check somewhere else for like lighter sweatpants because those were heavy. But I got the top that I tried on because I really liked how it fit. It's really warm, winter's coming. Um, I could put this under clothes with, during like deep winter. Or I could wear it out. It's just, it fits perfectly. It feels so nice and it's warm. Then I went to this Kim, not this Kim, Cotton On, because I needed uh, more solution for my contact lenses. I got lens wipes for my glasses. Then I got these uh, face masks. I really love this one. I'm always using it. feels really nice on my skin and it helps with dark marks. As you can see, I'm getting a lot of dark marks from all the pimples that I've been getting. Um, yeah, it feels really nice. I think I already have one already, but I wanted to get a, another one because I'm always, I'm always using these. And then luckily, I hardly find ones for spots and blemishes like the sheet masks. Um, so guys, please don't judge my nails. I'm going to deal with them. Nah, I think I'm judge. Um, so I got this as well. Um, I got two because then I, I took leave in like two weeks. So I plan to be out. I have plans and all that. So I really want my face to be looking better. Besides plans, I just want my face to be looking better. I hate these spots I've been getting. So I'm hoping this will help with that. And salicylic, sal did I say it right? That acid, no, this one, this one is really good for, for pimples and stuff. So yeah, that's what I got from Cake from Woods. I just got some fruits because I love me some fruits. Um, and Woods has good quality, like fruits and veggies, of course. Actually, everything. Mm. Um, 
and I got some dried fruits again fruits and I got a smoothie again fruits um yeah from Woods I also got this um toiletry bag because I'm a chronic traveler <laughs> not like that I'm not like I'm traveling to great places I just I'm always moving between my parents house my place because i don't like staying in this town as you guys if you've been watching my videos you know so i'm always like moving and my current toiletry bag is looking crusty and dusty and it needs to be replaced and it's great that it has like different sizes so that will help like if i'm going if i'm gonna need a lot of stuff i can use the big one if not the smaller ones or i can just use the smallest one as a toiletry as a makeup bag sorry um yeah that's all i got i'm exhausted guys after the run this morning i woke up at 4 a.m because i slept early i think that's another reason i couldn't gel at the mall anymore so i'm going to take a nap <laughs> thing you guys saw in this video but it's a monday this is probably gonna be as close to the end of this vlog oh i think y'all saw my little cleaning um montage i don't know what to call it but my skin is looking very dry right now because i just took a shower and i'm about to try on this mask let me just see because my skin has been really bad so we're gonna try this mask um i just took a while i was on my phone for too long after the shower and my skin ended up drying up but i don't want to put any products um any products because i knew i'd be trying on this mask so let's try it Guys, I really love these masks. But I'm trying to think if I've ever tried the spots and blemishes one. I always try, like I've men I mentioned earlier on in the vlog, uh, the skin brightening one. Um, but I, I really find the spots and blemish one, which is the one I'd actually want to try because my skin is very acne prone. Anyway, so we're going to let this sit, I think, for like 20 minutes. Is it 20? Yeah, 15 to 20 minutes and then we'll see okay guys so it's been 20 minutes probably longer than 20 minutes at this point so i'm going to remove this i'm just gonna throw it back in here and then the excess gel i'm just gonna rub all over my face And yeah, that's it. That's it. That's that's literally it. I'm excited to see if it actually like how much if I'm gonna see the difference. 
I think this is the end of the vlog guys. Thank you so much for watching. This was just a chill vlog. Living alone diaries, maintenance, self-sufficient maintenance. I think was in this vlog a bit. Work, gym, you know, my boring life. Um, but I hope you guys really enjoy. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, you know, do the things. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.